we're doing here is turning the light. It can come from anywhere in the dance. If we're dancing like this one, do a rock step, bring it back. Two, good ways is to grab her like that and push her as you turn her. Swap hands down, swap up, swap down. The man's slowly rotating as he as he raises and lowers the lady's arm. The lady's just going step, 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 step. No rock steps involved. So again, we've gone, we're leading to it back. Two, rock step, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two. Not too many times. There's lots of ways to have a very good lady. Now there's also a reverse version where the couples rotate around each other. So that comes from here. And you go rock step one two one two one two one two one two rock step. The difference between the two, this one is high, swap low, swap high, swap low, swap high, swap low. Now the other one, you're going rock step. One, two, three, four, five, six. Remember, if your partner's not done this before, they can get very giddy. So do it sensibly and have mercy. A nice little hint for the ladies. Try not to look up and down while you're doing it. Because the more you look up and down looking for the man's hand, the giddier you're going to get. Try and keep your hand, your head on one level and just lower your eyes to find where his hand is rather than moving your head backwards and forwards. It does help the giddies. The man should be placing the lady's hand in, in his. his hand, in his hand, in his hand. Exactly the same way the other way. Rotate, place the hand, place the hand, and that way you don't have any trouble finding the lady's hand. So the lady shouldn't be shouldn't looking for the hand. Because that will make you giddy. And always remember if you do it in a small room, you're more likely to get giddy than you are in a larger room because the walls tend to be moving quicker mm -hmm. in a small room. 